When you need advice, come to Ben and Kelly. It's group therapy on 99.7 DJX. So Lily says, hey, Ben and Kelly, first of all, love your show. Really love your group therapy segments. Thank you. Maybe you can help me out here. Okay. My boyfriend and I have been together for almost two years. Uh And for our anniversary, I want to go to Clearwater, Florida. Okay. The problem is my boyfriend doesn't want to go because I went there with my ex-husband for vacation years ago. Mm. Now, we've been divorced for six years. Mm -hmm. Haven't been there since. Mm -hmm. But I loved vacationing there. Mm Mm-hmm. He thinks it's weird to go on a vacation the same place I did with my ex. Mm -hmm. He said it would make him uncomfortable. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. It's not like we got married there. Okay. Is it weird to vacation the same place as you did with an ex? Mm -hmm. What would you say to him to get him on board? Or should I just resign myself to the fact I'm never going to Clearwater? (laughs) Oh, no. Thanks so much. Wow. Dang. Wow, there's uh, there's some extremes there. <laughs> there are some extremes there. Lily's for like, I short. guess I'm just never going to Clearwater ever. Bye, Clearwater. You were amazing. What? Yeah, mm. I okay. So I I I mean, I, was, I guess I see his point a little bit, but come on now, you can make new memories in Clearwater. She loves the beach. Oh yeah, I was gonna say. I feel like I've been to Clearwater before, and yeah, yeah, it's 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 the place that's right outside Tampa. Okay. Yes. Got it. I'm on board so, with it now. Yeah. No, it is. Uh, it's a sure. It's a beautiful place. Um, you know, part of me is like, it, it's weird because I am a guy. I have been in that situation where you know my new person is taking me to places that she's taken an ex, but. <laughs> So, I, I will say this. I will say this. I the place we honeymooned in, the resort we honeymooned in. Uh-huh. I had been there before. Did you know that? Did he know that beforehand? I'm not sure. <laughs> oh, in okay, so <laughs> if I was forthcoming with that information. So, so all right. So election. maybe, maybe. <laughs> I don't. Uh, because because I remember foggy on that. I remember us talking about this, and you're like, "Yeah, you know, I went on my honeymoon with a place that I went with my ex. No big deal. Whatever, go." And then, and then I th- got it, to thinking, I was like, "Well, did he? Did 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 your husband know?" I'm not sure if would, I was forthcoming with that information or so not. Would to that be honest? Do you think that would have made a difference? Uh, okay, I don't so, think. Well, I don't know. It yeah, I know. I, I know. And and guys can be weird about that sort of stuff. Right. I get yes. it. I get it. It's like marking your territory sort of thing. Right. You know, it's like a, a male dog and having to pee on every single uh, tree that they go by or fire. Right. Hydrant. It's but kinda... it was like it was again, it was about, you know, six years in the past. And so it was about the same kind of like time frame. <laughs> so, I mean, it's practically a brand new place, right? I mean, you it could was beautiful. I it mean, was too beautiful to like St. Lucia. It was a golf resort. Sure, sure. I mean, this I mean, was perfect for my husband. I mean, Kelly, you could ask him now if you I don't want. think we need to rehash that, to be honest. I don't think we need to rehash it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we need okay. to rehash it. <laughs> I'm just saying, water under the bridge now. What what's what difference does it make? Water under the bridge. <laughs> yeah. No. I did yeah. I don't know if my example's helping. Uh, uh, yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> you, had a, you, you had a very clear side at first. valid point. You had a very until, valid point at first until like, some, the story started I to unravel a little it. bit. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I mean, I, I get it. I get her. I get where her boyfriend's coming from. But at the same time, I'm like, man, if you didn't do something or if you didn't do something uh, or anything because of a place that you had gone or that your new person had gone with an ex yeah then then you're limiting yourself exactly like, you're limited that's, that's like re- refusing to eat at a restaurant that you ever ate at with a date or, a, or an ex-boyfriend or what if that's a place where m- maybe your fiance rip proposed at a place like that and, and then it's like your favorite you, restaurant right and it's, it's, it's your are spot. you never going to go there again because you had like a significant moment there with an ex oh man that would, I mean, if we're just if we're eliminating every like path way you, before, could you imagine walking into a 
restaurant where they kind of know you because you frequent it so much. And uh-huh. I'm going, hey, Kelly, long time no see. They're like, oh, oh, who's this? Uh, right. <laughs> like, who, right. Who do you have? Yes. Your, your normal spot? Uh, yeah, my normal <laughs> spot. <laughs> All right, so hey, have you been in this situation? Because clearly Kelly and I both have, and we have weird um, advice. Or we By don't... the way, I'm getting blackmail now from people like, hey, 100 bucks, I won't ever tell Michael. <laughs> Thanks, Keith. Keith, no. I'm tell- telling I'm... We don't need to send messages to my husband today like, hey, did you know? Uh, listen, I'm telling you, we could clear Kelly's the air right Lucia now. Before. No, we don't need to. We could clear no, the air. To. Why, why do we need this? We not do about this me. all the time on the radio. It's, it's not about me. It's about Lily. We're trying to help Lily here. Let's <laughs> but, focus. But it's also about Let's us. Let's focus. <laughs> all right. Uh, have you been in this situation? What did you do? How did you get your significant other on board? We want to hear those stories, all right? Or, or, like Kelly, <laughs> you didn't realize... Your partner had been to a spot until later. But does it matter? You had amazing <laughs> memories, right? I want to hear those stories because maybe that'll help Kelly also. All right. <laughs> we don't need to help me, though. <laughs> it's fine. We're moving past it. Okay. And, and until you <laughs> hit the go Tony back- Molino button. Uh, Why haven't you hit the Tony Molino until, button yet? Until you go back to St. Lucia. And, and you're like, wow, my third time here. And he's like, what? <laughs> he's like, what? You big slut. Good for you. That was not the oh, right that was button. The wrong one. Yeah. yeah. That was the wrong. Understand? Things happen. The past is the past. I mean, they both kind of work, though. All right, 502 795 1997. So there's a big reason why Lily's boyfriend doesn't want to go on vacation with her to Clearwater, Florida. She loves that place, by the way. It's because she used to go there with her ex husband. Of course, they've been divorced for six years. How she get them on board? All right. Yeah, that's really the, the we need to. It's it's not that you know. Let's justify his feelings. It's like let's push his feelings aside and let's get him on board with the trip. <laughs> let's, let's let's not worry about his feelings. Let's not worry about it. Exactly. Feelings. See, Brandy says my husband and his family go on this big camping trip to Santa Claus, Indiana, every year. Heard Our of the first place? year together. Yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, our first year together, and I, I went, and it was a little weird because mm-hmm. he had just taken someone different two years before sure. I went. But we go every year now. This is going to be my fourth year going. We just make new memories with each other and don't talk about the past. Yeah, I will say that it was a little weird for me when I went to the spot where my wife and her family vacationed for years. And she had taken, you know, and uh, her ex-boyfriend and her ex-boyfriend before that, you know, I mean, so so it had been a spot in their family for a long time. And so it was a little bit, maybe a bit weird the first time I went because it was like, oh, you know, I went here or, or this is a great spot. You know, she's like showing me around and things like that. And in the back of my head, I'm thinking, oh, well, did she have a good time with him here? <laughs> yeah, exactly. It was uh-huh. like, oh, huh. OK, so did okay. you and Dave enjoy this place too <laughs> what about you and jacob and oh but how many people did she take there two what's happening two. Oh, wow i know but you know it's like third time's a charm though yeah exactly see i worked. yes it worked see? out for me so chad says i can see both sides but as long as you're not staying in the same hotel airbnb or house and same resort that you honey anyway <laughs> um creating new memories Doing something different's okay. I would definitely refrain from bringing the X up if you all happen to go. For example, when I came down here with such and such's name, we did this too. Just be careful with his feelings because men are just as sensitive as women, yet they'll never admit it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I love this little cove. This little... Uh, <laughs> oh, you know, when Tim and I were here, this same bartender made us amazing drinks too. Yeah, I understand. <laughs> Things happen. The past is the past. Oh my gosh, this is exactly. such a very secluded grotto. I know, right over here. Stop talking. We right can now. kind of go there. Stop. I, I, <laughs> We're going to a different grotto. Different grotto. We're going to a different grotto. <laughs> this is definitely a different grotto than the one I went to.
<laughs> See, now Kimberly is saying your partner has clearly communicated this situation makes him uncomfortable. Your attempt to justify your position is dismissive and borderline disrespectful. Oof. Simply select another location that's still located on the Gulf, like St. Petersburg. The new location yeah. having the same beach ocean will allow you to create memories with the new partner. That's not a bad suggestion. There are many, many, many beautiful places to go on the Gulf in Florida. Wow, well, I mean, in America, there's plenty yes. of beautiful beaches. Oh, a thousand I mean, percent. Not, but, but I'll not tell just you, the, Florida. The I mean, sand, Gulf though, Shores, Alabama, like the, like yes, the Carolinas. The Gulf, the, the Gulf side, the, the sand is gorgeous. Yeah. Um, and, and there are some people that are like, hey, save clear water for a girl's trip. Why don't you just guys like find a new oh, that's spot? that's a good idea. You know? That's a good idea. Okay. If you want to be mature about it, great. If you don't, just may, how do you get them on board? Maybe just convince them like, hey. Yeah, I understand. Things yes. happen. The past yes. is the past. And mm-hmm. you say, look, I want to create these memories with you. Yes. It's all about... I love this place, but I'll love it even more now with that you I'm going next to be to there with you. Yep. Yes. You're going to make it even more special. All right. Well, hey, good luck. I don't know if we helped or not, but, you know, that's what we're here for. Gave you some good. You know what? Destin is nice. That's where we're going. Destin's real nice. All right. Well, there you go. Maybe you can go and be with Kelly and her family. Hang out with us. <laughs> okay. Just don't, let's not mention St. Lucia. <laughs> that is group therapy. <laughs>